，让我们直觉，通过直觉知道感觉或理解。直觉一，快速而准备好的洞察力。二，无需有一时的推理就能知道事物的能力。Hello. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Let's get into it. I'm Kenyatta. This will be a reading from the Hoodoo Tarot deck. The title of this reading is the name. Okay. So let's find out about this name. Whose name? What name? Okay. Whose name is it? Whose real name is it? Okay. Why did they call you this name? Okay. Why were you given this name? Okay. I mean, why were you? Hold on. I'm hearing I heard blessed with this name. I wanted to be sure I was hearing the right thing. I heard it's a blessing and a curse. Okay. I don't know how. We we'll, hopefully we'll see. Okay. But for some reason, and maybe we'll see it in the reading. It was more of a blessing than a curse. Okay. I don't know. Let's see. But the name itself was cursed. It was meant to bring cursings upon your life. Okay, so how could it be more of a blessing than the curse? I don't know. We're going to find out. Hopefully. <laughs> okay, I'm asking how I'm here. You will see. All right. I don't know. The name was given to you. I'm here to bless you. Okay, to shield you, to cover you. There are others after you. There were others after you, coming after you, okay, to grow you and groom you in their fold, okay? I'm gathering that this was not a very positive uh, group here, a community, okay? I mean, it was at one time, at one point in time, but no longer, okay? By the time you came along, okay, born and, and whatnot, okay? It was, oh Lord, honey, I'm here, it was meant to devour, okay? And devour is what it did, okay? So obviously there was some changes in the, uh, the mission here of whatever this group or community was, okay? So they wanted to shield you, okay, or quote unquote protect you, okay, I'm hearing, okay, from this organization, from this group. So they could not find you, they did not want you to be found, Who I'm, I or obviously didn't want you to be found. I'm just hearing others, okay? That's all I got for now. And that's literally what I heard. That's all I got for now. That's all you're going to hear. That's all you're going to know for the time being, okay? Maybe more light will be shed on it in the reading. We'll see. But the name is a lie, okay? It's not your true name. It's your alias, okay? I give no fit nooks. <laughs> And obviously, there's a reader who says that I'm not copying off of her, but I do like when she says that, okay? So sometimes I'll be around town saying I give no fit nucks, okay? But I give no fit, and I don't know if that's a slang term, okay? She's the only person I ever heard use it, okay? But anyway, I give no fit nucks what the goddamn um, birth certificate says, okay? Because that's a lie. Okay? That has already been covered, okay? I'm surely I'm not the only person. There are others, okay, many others, a few others out there just like you is what I'm hearing, okay, with this fake, faulty, uh, you know, name, okay, but like I said, I heard the name was an alias, okay, it was meant to cover you, to hide you, to shield you, okay, from these others, whoever the fuck these others, who and whatever the fuck these others are. I got a couple cards turned around in here. So we're gonna see what we can find out here from from the Hoodoo Tarot deck. All right, let's get into it. Okay, ten of coins here, upright. Big Mama, upright. Doctor Buzzard in reverse. Them bones in reverse, and we have Daughter of Knives, upright. Okay, pretend. 
okay? There was a made-up, pretend, um, happy home and happy family here, okay? You were a part of it, okay? Again, this was done to hide you and shield you, okay? From, I just keep hearing from others, but I keep, honestly, I keep hearing from the others, okay? Whoever these others were, okay? Um, then I feel like things were set up to make it look like everything was happy, everything was promising, everything was wonderful and grand and great, okay? That this is the type of home that you come from, that you had everything that you needed and everything was just a big, wonderful, happy home, but there was an injustice here. Too many lies told, okay, to cover and shield you. But I feel like it obviously grew to something else over time. Maybe. I could be wrong. But there was no happy home here, okay, in the way that it was made. The nice nuclear family, mommy and husband and the wife and the other children and grandparents. And we're just so happy and wonderful and everything's just happy, happy. Just like America says it is. It's wonderful. You have everything you need. Aren't you happy? And I do not feel that that is uh, exactly where you came from. This home was not yours. Okay. But you were made to partake. Okay. In other words, you was placed here. Not legally. Okay, so don't be, now this is for, put, put, don't put your foot in a shoe that don't fit you. Don't try to make it fit. If it don't. Now that may be parts, once again, that resonate with you. But there may be parts that don't, so don't try to make something resonate with you that just doesn't. And build some kind of uh, fantasy world. That is incorrect for your life. All right. You deaf damn sure wasn't supposed to find this shit out. Now, like I said, this was this name was an alias was supposed to protect you, shield you, cover you, blah, blah, blah. Too many lies told, okay? Probably uh, turned into something else crazy, okay? Or maybe not. Not quite sure. Okay? But you damn sure weren't supposed to find this out. Nobody was supposed to find this out. Okay? But you are who you fucking are. Your ancestors here was with you. You are who you are. And here they came to say, wake up. See all these hands around her here. Wake up. You got a, something to tell you, a show to tell you about. You're being watched, stalked. <laughs> Which may be true. These others, whoever these others are, have never stopped watching you. They fucking know who you are. But this was supposed to be some kind of cover. I don't know why. Color Jack in reverse. Three of six. Upright. Daughter of baskets in reverse. And we have the seven of baskets upright. Okay. So if you were supposed to be some kind of, it have something to do with your fucking bloodline, whoever your real parents are. Okay. Who knows who they are and what the fuck they were involved in or a part of. I don't know. Okay. Maybe this was supposed to be some kind of protective type, quote unquote, custody type thing for the child of or the children of. Okay. Um, you hear, uh, Okay, where, you know, it, it might have been a target, okay? So this was done to, again, shield, protect, cover, so they would not find you. But I feel like you, you may never have been told this, and maybe why would you have been? Shit, I don't know, okay? But you may have looked and realized something is off about all of this shit. Can't fucking pinpoint it. Don't know what the fuck it is. But something strange. Even this name is interesting. Who gave me this name and why? 
why would you call me this? Not that it's a bad name, but if it if it if you questioned it. I feel like here in even though it was meant to shield and protect, it set you apart. You were not supposed to be looked at in a positive light either. And I think things were set up here for you in such a way that you would not uh, feel like you wouldn't have any options. So you would not go out there and explore life in the world. We got to cover hat and protect that day. Aunt Caroline has made her way into the building. Upright, ten of baskets in reverse here. And we have... Black Herman, upright. Okay. This was, I feel like this was supposed to go in your favor. This was supposed to work in your favor. Okay. And Caroline says, I was watching, protecting, and shielding. Even though you do not belong here, you're not of this fold. I know who you are. I know exactly who you are. So I watched you, protected you, and shielded you, okay, with the best that I had capable of me within my hands to do. And I do feel, hold on. Aunt Caroline did this along with your other ancestors, your real ancestors, who was, wake up. Now, for some reason, they felt like, you need to know this. Who are you? So what was made to look like nice, sweet, happy, him wasn't family. Or that you recognize and realize that you were not, like she said, a part of this fold here, this community, this home that you were placed in. Here we have Ten of Knives in the verse, Ace of Sticks upright, Dr. Grant in reverse. Hmm. <laughs> Black Herman said, I'm going to knock this shit right on down. Okay. This, okay, plant here, this drum here, okay, uh, calling. Am I hearing that and am I understanding that correctly? This calling here, and I'm here, you most definitely are. I don't know what this means so far, I'm hearing. This was some kind of, this was a calling here upon your life, your world, your realm, okay? Uh, listen, to hurt, harm, and destroy. If the name could be called, okay, over and over again, Okay, it would be set here to do just that. Now, you now this is interesting because in one realm, this was supposed to be an alias, a cover up, protect this child of or these children of here, but at the same time, okay, I'm hearing this was not your name, this was not your given name at the same time. The more this name was said, the more this name was said. See, the names are important. The more this name was said, the more this name was called. I'm hearing. It was set to hurt you, to manipulate you, to destroy you. So I don't know if some kind of curse was placed on the name. It most definitely was. Now, that might not have been the original intention of the name. It was meant, once again, to protect.
harbor you. That's what I heard, harbor. I want to make sure. A place of security and comfort, shelter, refuge. So that these others, okay, could not manipulate them here and could not find you. But they did. Because there were some others who were in contact with them. To let them know your whereabouts, your whenabouts, your howabouts, etc., etc., when they were not supposed to. I'm feeling like they were given funds, money, lots, to keep you shielded and protected. But at the same time, they were given any even more here. Okay, basically to betray. Whatever. The more the name was said, the more the name was spoken, a curse had been placed on it, okay, to manipulate your energy and bring you down, down, down. Okay. I'm asking, am I correct in understanding that you most definitely are? That's exactly what took place. The name I'm hearing holds a heavy weight. From the, the curse. It is too heavy. You should remove it. Please. I'm not telling nobody to fucking change their name. I'm doing a reading. Don't put your foot in a shoe that don't fit that damn. That's either too small or too fucking big. Like it or not. The betrayal here that was supposed to take place, the fullness of it in full did not. <coughs> it did not work here. What they were trying to do. And I'm also hearing some shit about uh, replace you. I don't know about that. Maybe they got some doppelganger out there. Okay, they, they had ready to replace you after they knocked you off. Shit. Day is gone. We did it. Yay! Now where's such and such to replace the ass? Your fucking a doppelganger clone, whatever the fuck. Did you get the money from the, the others? Who and whatever the fuck that is. Okay. It did not come together as planned. But that name got in. It's time to take their name up off your record is what I'm hearing. It's not yours. It never was. Okay. It was to place an identity on you. To keep you from yourself. Yes, okay, harbor you, protect you, blah, blah, blah. Uh, but turned into something else by who the fuck ever. Let me see. Do I need to ask that? One of these uh, fake false family members who didn't love you, didn't care nothing about you. Oh, we got to take this in. We getting paid for it, Betty Sue. All right. Fuck their life up. Wait a minute, one of them others called. How much they say they were going to give? They better not find out the real people the child belong to. What they want us to do. Hurt the child. Kill the child. Destroy the child. For how much? I feel like this did not uh, happen here in fullness um, for a number of reasons. But I also feel like um, there's a lot of power here with you. 
Hell, maybe you wanted of the fucking chosen, goddamn. I don't know. Very powerful person. Or you come from a powerful bloodline. That whoever these fucking others was was like, we got to get rid of that right there. That child or the children of. Too much power. They got a mind of their own. We don't like that shit. How can you tell if the child is born? We know. And like I say, you are not alone. This has happened to more than one person, okay? Obviously, there have been a few. That's what I'm hearing. Now, in comparison to the uh, a number of people walking the earth, a few might seem like a large number, I, you know, uh, but still a few. But hell, it might literally only mean only three. They always said a few is a three or more. What's the max, goddamn? <laughs> I always wondered that. Never asked. Okay. Three or more. <laughs> Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, a hundred, what? They just said three or more. But again, there are others here who are bearing this cross. They may not know. They may just feel something is not right and something is off. And they may be even wondering about this name. What is the history of this name? Why did you give me this name? I don't mean look up what the name mean and blah, blah, blah. You can do that. There might be some connection there as well, but maybe not. Your name is supposed to say who you are. Hell, every time has a meaning, goddamn. Every time you call a person by their name, you calling, you're saying that meaning of that name. Placing that energy on them, the energy of that name on them. That that's who and what you are. I'm hearing remove it, time to remove it once again to whomever uh, this resonates with. For real. That's it. Thank you.